<laughs> yes, indeed. That's right. And we're going to show you just how to do exactly that. So get up off the couch, get your workout gear on, or stay in your pajamas. It doesn't matter. And we're going to get you to gear up for an extraordinary rugby experience with Clover and score a chance to see the thrilling showdown between South Africa and Scotland taking place in France. An epic occasion, and five lucky viewers and their partners will embark on a glorious cruise from the picturesque Marseille, setting sail to the dazzling paradise of Ibiza. It sounds like an absolute dream. So let's get into the spirit of things, right? So you don't have to be as fit as a rugby player for this morning's exhilarating workout. You just need a friend to maybe help you along. Or you can do it on your own. It doesn't matter. Now, we're going to be taking you through a high-energy acronym workout where each letter of the word clover represents a different exercise. Yeah, we're going to have some fun with this one. So get ready to sweat it out and have a blast at the same time. And come join myself and Carlitos as we are dressed in turquoise and ready for action. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you were going to wear that color, okay? Just yeah, man, yeah, shorts, man. Look, it's okay. let's do this thing. You're my couple for the day. All we're going right. straight into it. So, you know how we spot Clover? Yes, What's honey. What's the first letter? Yes, honey, C. Give me a C. C. What's and C? It's... Crunches. Oh, yeah. I you see C how we do it. Okay, but it's fine. Crunches you could probably fine. use some incredible ingredients it's from Clover a, okay. to make a cake, but right now, we're getting our workout on. So 10 reps, nice and easy, guys. For you at home, for your crunches, you simply want to have your feet at about 90 degrees at an angle. Keep your feet planted on the ground. So a lot of people might struggle with doing their push-up and yeah. trying to get up here. The real goal is to keep your feet nice and static. Okay. Have your hands behind your head. And 10 reps, nice and easy. Let's go. One, beautiful. Two, you keep your hands behind your head. This exercise, as simple as it is, Carl, is so humbling. It I love it. Use the ads. I love crunches so much. I think they're <laughs> underrated. You know. You're one of the first person that uh, people that I've heard saying they love crunches. I do love crunches. <laughs> because crunches are better than burpees. They are. I'm not gonna they lie. Are. And just like that, 10 reps done and dusted. Very easy. And we're moving over to the next letter. So we got the C in Clover. So What's would next? Be for, um, let me guess, lunges. Oh, you guessed correctly. Lunch Let's time. I love it. Now, you can have fun with this one yeah. if you're really good at lunges. You can do jump lunges, but we're not that advanced. We're going to keep it basic. Okay. We're going to go for reverse lunges, right? Cool. So keep your stability, get a nice big reach, stabilize yourself as you're bringing the one foot back. Once you've touched the ground, simply lower yourself down, keep a nice neutral spine, engage that glute, especially when you're rising up, and then you can alternate to the other side. Ten reps in total, five on each side, and that will give you your finished workout for the letter L. Nice and easy. So we got the C, we got the L. What's yes. next? We got the O. It's gonna have to be something that's O. Oh. Oh. Over. Oh. Overhead. Yeah. Oh. Ah. <laughs> overhead. So we're gonna push something up overhead, but what do we use, of course? We got a rugby ball here, so maybe you can have that scene that we are okay. talking about cool. this great game. I'm gonna grab a clover product. Let me get something nice and heavy. Okay. Oh, all right. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna go for a squat, right? Yes. And then press the weight over our head. Okay. Beautiful stuff. I like your form. I like the fact that you're getting your head through your arms, getting a nice full press and a lockout as you place either your ball or your clover product, or whatever it is that you have that has lots of weight. And you're gonna go for 10 reps in total. Love. We're doing overhead presses right now. Add a little squat in just to get you that rugby fitness. As <laughs> I'm sure you'll know Lovely. all rugby players you know, with strong legs. How are you feeling on that side, I've always wanted to work out with you. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I, feel like my, I feel like my summer body is building as I speak. It's like there, man. Like what do you mean? I'm, bro, I've been this seeing is, you working out. I've been seeing great. you doing that. No, like, it's you. I'd say I'm That I'm CrossFit thing as okay. well. Man's looking good. <laughs> no, so, hold on. C-L-O. V. V. What on earth can we do with a V? Uh, v. You can vent. You know, like yesterday, <laughs> no, no, or well, we can do something cool, which I think backline players would love, the locks would love for the line out, a vert jump. Vertical Ooh, jump. Okay, nice yeah. and easy. We're testing how high you can jump. So Mzanzi, this is a great chance for you to see how good you are jumping. Maybe you're a basketball player, not a rugby player. We don't know. Yeah. But right now, this is all about rugby. So what you yeah. want to do, really load up the legs, all right? Keep your spine nice and neutral. You can use your arms to kind of assist you and Woo! As high as you can up in the air, 10 times. Make sure you cushion the landing, all right? Perfect. Because you can injure yourself if you land badly on your ankle or do something crazy. So as high as you can, 10 opportunities to jump as high as possible. Maybe even make a mark on the wall. Oh, try nice. to reach the ceiling. I see a light there. That's going to be my goal. So and you try to jump goal. as high as you can. Boom! 10 reps in total, nice Fantastic. and easy. All right, so we're pretty much almost there, right? Yeah, so C-L-O-V, we need E. e so, e, right, so e could be like uh, E for elbows. Let's get on elbows and do a plank. 
nice and easy. So this one would be quite simple. Either you could go for reps, but of course we don't have a rep count okay. on this one. We're just going to stick into this position, okay. hold it for a minute, and that'll be your elbow. This is a nice plank. elbow. Because yeah. If you want to make it more sexy, you can kind of go up on here Ooh, if you want. Yeah, to. I like that. Right. So we could actually use it as a rep. We could count that one rep. One. Okay. And then that's two. Two. Nice. I like that. Okay. Three. And then it's also you feel that in the obliques as well, which is now really we're talking, cool. Man. And now you're really pushing there. Yes. Great. And R is for Ryle. Hey! I get to give you a hug. <laughs> R is going to be nice and fun. This is my oh, favorite no. run. Russian twist. Everybody's done. Oh, this. these you can ones. Get again, grab your ball if you want to. Okay, cool. I'll grab a crush. And essentially having the weight in your hand, touching either side of the floor while keeping your legs in the air. And you're going for 10 reps in total. These are Russian twists. And we've officially spelled out Clover! <laughs> so I don't know how much you enjoyed that, Mzanzi, that was but great, I did. Eh? It did. This is a great way that. to have fun. You can do this with your family. Like she also said as well, couple goals. If you want to train together, get a great relationship on, then you can do exactly that too. But right now, whew, we've worked ourselves up a sweat. I've earned this one, and you have. So is Glad. my workout I mean, partner over here. Since Man, you've got options. No, no, I'm still going to grab. You've got options. I'm going to grab the butter. Aim for the butter. <laughs> but for you, Zanzi, don't forget, here's a reminder, physical fitness is a passport to greatness in the world of rugby, as you've just seen. And speaking of passports, you might want to get yours ready. Yes, don't miss out on Clover's Rugby Experience Competition. Now, to enter, buy any Clover product and keep your tool slip handy. Then dial star 120, star 560, hash, and then follow the prompts. It's that simple. On top of this, you can keep watching Espresso daily to find out more. Your T's and C's can be found at clover.co.za. So what are you waiting for? Get involved. We'll see you there. <laughs> Cheers. Butter them up, baby. <laughs>